Hey y'all, I was talking to my friend one day and she was telling me how she was learning jiu-jitsu. Jiu-jitsu is like wrestling but even more complicated. She told me that the way they teach you is that you learn through grappling with someone else. Basically, you find yourself in a bind and you have to figure out a way to get yourself out. When you're put on the mat for the first time, you have to learn to trust instinct and not necessarily direction or instruction. She said that her opponent had gotten her in a type of hold that was uncomfortable and she couldn't breathe well. All she wanted was out. In the midst of desperation, she paused. She stopped fighting. It wasn't until then that she discovered she could move a part of her body that she had never really noticed before. That was a game changer because it was how she won her match on her first day of learning jiu-jitsu. As she was telling that story, I couldn't help but think that it's the same with God. You have to trust the Holy Spirit and not always what you know, and it is then that you discover skills you didn't know you had. Sometimes we find ourselves in binds in our lives and we can't do what we've always done to get ourselves out because that makes things worse for you. And you can't use what you know because that doesn't work at all. So you feel stuck in this uncomfortable bind and this person's on top of you, squeezing the life out of you and you're claustrophobic. Or maybe it's this thing, the situation, this bad habit that's suffocating you. Yet the only way to freedom is learning to rest in God's presence. Trusting the Holy Spirit and allowing Him to show you parts of yourself that you didn't know were in you to free you.